GCSA welcomes you to the afternoon session here at Grand Vista. You received a map when you got off the bus. This shows you the four stations that you will visit today. You will spend about 30 minutes at each session and then we will move you on to the next. Uh, we're out here doing a GCSA interactive uh, facility tour. A lot of learning, good process, better than being in a classroom all day. Best, best classroom you can be is out here. Nice sunny day today and uh, we're enjoying it. Yeah, so this summer we just did a renovation in Diamond Zoysia Greens, which we're gonna talk yeah. quite a bit about here today. A little bit about overseas. You get right where it broke off, you can see the fine textured soil that the sod came with. Mm -hmm. Right, and that is one of the challenges that you've had to confront here, Matt, yes. right? Is that, not, they're not washing the sod. Yeah. It comes with a little bit of soil on it. The one thing that I remind everybody of when you plant zoysia, the first 30 days, you don't see anything on top. It's all underneath. The rhizomes grow first. Uh, it's great because it's much better to have the position here to, to touch to have the feeling that in the classroom. And I believe that with this tour, uh, the GZA uh, gained a lot. We're presenting uh, the Toro Company Sprinkler Innovation, how we've innovated through the years uh, with sprinklers and where we, what kind of features we have as of today. So we've tried to, to design different nozzle patterns or different nozzle choices to give you the throw that you want out in the field. The, the plug nozzle, now we're just utilizing the medium throw nozzles, the short throw nozzle and the medium throw. So if you plug that main nozzle, it's still gonna turn, it's still gonna be a golf course sprinkler, but now we're only throwing maybe 35 to 50 feet, somewhere in that range by using those two outer nozzles. Right now we are demonstrating our hybrid autonomous fairway mower. So this machine is designed to mow fairways autonomously in an effort to provide alternative labor solutions to an industry that is frankly struggling to attract talent and labor and fill the positions that we have available. This machine works by its controlled via web application. It has manual and autonomous mode. The machine is supervised. The supervisor can oversee multiple machines on property and perform other tasks on property to extend the labor available to our customers. This is about what I expected. They don't over inundate you with information, but you get enough to, to get the taste of what you're looking for and you want to pursue it. You got options and people you can get a hold of now to find out a little more. It's just a great way to learn from other people in the business. You know, even if you're in northern climate, southern climate, Europe, Asia, wherever you are, everybody brings something to the table and you can learn from each other. And I think that's the best part about it.